In this video, I'm going to show you how can we deploy a Blazor Wasm app to GitHub page. GitHub page is one of the cool features to host any static web app. Let's see. See, sometimes we are looking for a free service to host static websites. A static, static websites like a Blazor Wasm app. So, what do I need to do that? GitHub. A GitHub account. I'm not going to play with GitHub commands and such things. I want to visually create a github repository and do everything very fast and easy so first of all let's jump to github okay github repositories so i'm going to create a new repository here blazer Vasim Git Hop Page Sample Something like that. The name does not matter. Description Hosting a Blazor Vasim app on a free github page feature or I can say facility that's all no need to touch anything else just create repository done okay copy this as I said I'm not going to deal with these comments I'm going to jump to Visual Studio and do everything visually let's do that Visual Studio git clone repository paste it here clone and done open I'm going to add just a simple index.html file. Let's paste the content from somewhere else. This is the content. Finish. Git. First. H index.html done so let's go back to github now inside my repository i have index.html so even now i would be able to use github page feature to just deal with this simple index.html how settings pages i'm going to choose main branch i'm not going to create a new branch it's okay save sometimes it's it takes time a little bit to show you the page that github page is creating for you okay my url is here so as i said you have to wait a little bit so if i browse this what would i see let's check This is the uh, simple HTML page that I have just created and then pushed to the GitHub repository. 
So, is that what I want? No. As I said, the plan is creating a Blazor Wasm app and then host it to the same place as I am using now. So, let's create a Blazor Wasm app in the Visual Studio. I will open another Visual Studio. I want to keep the one that I am dealing with GitHub as it is and I will create another project in another Visual Studio instance. Guys, it's not a big deal. See, file, new, project, Blazor Wasm app, next, Wasm for static pages in, no, the name is too long, static page sample. I can say Wasm. A static page sample everything is fine create if you were or you are familiar with blazer wasm you know what is going to happen and you know if i run it what you gonna see so i'm not going to run it even run it i'm going to publish it so publish folder next I will find the right place for it let me pause and create a folder for myself this is my folder finish then AOT should be activated it's not mandatory but I like it save publish we need to wait if it takes time I will pause the recording and would be back once everything could be done. Yes, I have to pause. Okay, it's done. So if I open folder, you will see a www root folder and I need it. What I'm going to do, I'm going to first of all, Remove that index HTML page that I have created and pushed to the GitHub. So let's do that. This guy should be gone. Bye bye. The next thing that I am going to do is opening this folder and paste all the things that I have inside the www root folder in the publish, in the release, into this place. So I will do that. As you can see, I have copied and pasted all the www root folder context into this folder. And then we need to commit and push everything into or github repository again see like this like this i haven't done anything professionally i just selected all the files and then committed and then i pushed everything so let's check my repository at first. As you can see, files are here. But if I go to that URL, I won't see something correct. Let's see. What is this? I was expecting to see a default Blazor app. But what is this? We need to fix some broken things inside the repository to be able to make it work. So, what should we do that? 
I will show you. First of all, inside index.html, edit in place. The address that I am dealing with should be here in base dot base href like this exactly like this see I got the name from here paste it here and as I said I am doing everything visually so commit this is the first step in the second because we are dealing with this underlying framework we need to create another file in here what file wait and see just choose add file create new file the name should be this exactly this nothing should be inside the file just create it here that's all and then we need a 404.html file also so add file 404.html the context would be whatever we have inside the index.html so i will save it i do that because i wanted to do everything in front of your eyes so I will come back to 404.html Edit in place I will paste everything here Commit Done Do you know what else should I do? Mm, nothing It's done So can I see a default blazer app inside the url that github page has given us i think so let's see uh yes it's here see done finish so as long as you are dealing with a static context GitHub page would be a right place for you to deal with such things. It is a free host for you to do anything you want. See? Instead of GitHub, there is so many other uh, places that you can host like Azure Static Web App. In Azure Static Web App also you can do the same. And Azure Static Web Apps are not that expensive. So that one also is one of the other places that you can try. But since GitHub page is free, you can do the same things inside here without any cost. So for example, if you are going to demo something, if you are looking for a place to host something without paying any money, GitHub page is the right place to do that. Thank you so much. Continue coding.